delicious warm soup. Now we're going to show you how to make a smoothie using the Optimum 9400 and uh, the Ninja Blender. And we're going to see if we get the same results. We mm. definitely had a completely different result between the two blenders when it came to the warm soup. So let's have a look at, if I can get it apart, what we see here with this delicious um, juice recipe. We're going to squeeze the juice of a lime straight in there. We've got some cucumber, some celery, We've chosen some hard ingredients like the apple and even some beetroot along with some fresh parsley leaves. So I'm noticing again, hard to get everything in the Ninja Blender because of all those blades. So we'll add some water, get the lid on and making sure everything's lined up. There we go. Ready to rock, Rory? Ready to rock. So we're going to do 30 to 40 seconds, exactly the same time on exactly the same high speed. Well, different high speeds, mm. but exactly the same high speed. Blended them both for uh, just over 30 seconds. I'm going to release the lid and we're going to pour them into the glasses and just see if we can uh, see any texture difference. Straight away I notice a difference because in the lid of the um, mm. Ninja there's a kind of thick paste going through everything there. And then we'll take the bottom off. Making sure that you be really careful when you remove these kind mm. of blades because you don't want to cut yourself or do any damage to everything around you. Let's see what we've got here. Well, there's a definite difference right away between the two. And we'll have mm. a little look up close. I can see that that one's quite gritty mm. and pithy all together, whereas that one looks smoother mm. straight away. I'm going to have a taste of both. Mmm, crunchy. Mm, great, crunchy. <laughs> This is a really, really smooth texture. As a matter of fact, we'll actually do the paper test again because mm. I think you'll be able to really visibly see. Mm. It might be hard to see on the camera there, but one is smooth and the other one is literally a chewy mixture. Mm. So let's have a little look. As you can tell with the paper test, one is smooth, one is chunky. It is very, very easy to tell the difference between the two blenders. Mm, there's a reason they're called smoothies and not chunkies as well, I might add. <laughs> it's very true. And I prefer mine to be smooth. Smooth, yeah. So uh, no comparison at all between the two blenders. We've had a look. It's an objective look from our perspective and mm, using absolutely. them. We've made a couple of different things, hot, cold and in between. Um, we think the Optimum 9400, thumbs up. <laughs>